or with Dimparabat, called WDA. All right. Get a request for a web Dimper ABAP. Let's go to my framework, look at the modeling that the developer's done. From there, um, we've got a, you know, like an HTML generator, right? On the fly, from the model, generate the HTML and give the response, right? All of those concepts I've just talked about from here onwards, when I talk about ITS, the integrated ITS, right? so from around here. It's all been made possible by this. But what you, uh, often people don't know, and most customers don't even know, is you can actually go one level lower. You can write your own little class, little program that says, at the most basic level, I'm getting a, a request, and I want to give a response. Okay. And that means you could create your own BSP framework if you're really clever, right? Well, I wouldn't even dare do a web program that amount of work. But it's important to understand because the world's moving to very simple interactions with the server layer and mobile is helping to on the device. And that's more than just the normal caching that your browser does. That's actually say, really take this HTML template and shove it into the device and it's there permanently. <coughs> until we tell you otherwise, that's serious stuff. HTML5 also lets you to store data on the device. So what I'm saying is HTML templates can now be stored on the device and data can be stored on the device. So all we need now to build an application is dynamic data exchange. Right? We can even have offline capable apps now using HTML5. Right? But that separation of layer and data is critical. Because right? what you want to do, you want to in one the first pass you just send the layouts to the device, right? And then underpinning this, you might have to use some JavaScript that goes off and says, "Hey, this is in an HTML. Give me this. Give me this XML. It references a path to the ICM, right? You write a bit of code under there. Here's a request for a customer list. The code is in there is as simple as select star from, you know." customer um, table and then let's send it back in XML format and seriously it could be as low level as concatenate and then, you know like you actually put the strings together in its lowest form right not using all fancy BSP or does that make sense <coughs>